What is up, everybody? Welcome on in to Taste Test right here on YouTube.com slash Rex. My name is Sean, and this is a lovely show that I post every single Saturday where I try the weird, the wonderful, the store exclusive, and the whatever. If you like, would like more of that content, be sure to scroll down, subscribe, ring that bell. You'll be notified when I post new videos. You can see me play games or try things on the internet for your amusement. Today, we have... The Angry Orchard Fall Hall. Now, I know, I know. You looked at the thumbnail, you're looking at the intro little image there, and it says Explorer's Pack. I get it, I understand. It's not called Fall Hall, it's called Explorer's Pack. It is the same contents of the Fall Hall uh, that they put out every year. So, they are wrong. Not me for calling it Fall Hall, like I did in the title of this video. Okay? I'm right. The company who made the product, they are the ones who are wrong. I don't know why it's called the like Orchard Explorers or whatever the hell it's called. Um, because it is the Fall Hall, it's just in bottles instead of cans. Um, so I don't know. This is kind of a weird mix because it has two that were in last year's Fall Hall. And it has two new flavors. One of them I'm not really interested in. I basically bought a full 12 pack of beers for $21 for one or for three of them for a quarter of them, which is not good. I had to check and do my math in my head. I was like, is that, is that a quarter? Did I goof that up? Or was that supposed to be a third? No, it's a quarter. It's a quarter. Now, uh, this is one of the more expensive things I've had on the show. And it's kind of a weird situation where they just opened a grocery outlet in the area that I live in um, that did not have the banana caramel Cheerios I was looking for, but don't worry. I was peeled for that. Could because I got a lovely text. I was like, "Hey, here's this. I found that at my. I found this at my grocery outlet." And then uh, because I know you, how much you love banana, I was like, "Okay, I will. I will go look for it." Um, I had seen that they had an alcohol section, and then I had noticed that they had Angry Orchard. Now, if you know the grocery outlet, the prices are typically lower. Um, it likes they like to do the like. $2.99 here, elsewhere, $6.99, and it's like the highest price they can find. Whatever. You still save a good amount of money. This isn't an ad for Grocery Outlet, but it very well could be. Contact me. Uh, I would love free money. Now, what I was hoping for was that I would not only get the Fall Hall, but I would get it at a discount. Unfortunately, it was only half right. I was able to get the fall haul a little bit after it had been, it had been out of stock at other places. I'd seen it a couple of times, but I just couldn't push myself to pull the trigger. I was like, ah, do I really need this? And then I saw it at the grocery outlet and I was like, this feels like it's going to be my last shot to, to give this, to give this four pack a whirl. So you know what? YOLO, YOLO, it'll all work out. And here we are. That's, that's the explanation. Uh, I took the, uh, I took the thumbnail with the box so that I could open these and put them in the fridge because there's not room in our fridge for an entire 12 pack of bottles. So I just have the bottles sitting next to me. We are going to start with the original just to kind of get our taste buds figured out, get it situated with a crisp apple. Then we're going to move on to one of two new flavors. And that one is the hardcore Dark cherry apple. I do not like cherry. Um, so this one is one of the one of the flavors where I'm like, ah, crap. Like, it really sucks that this one's in here because I would avoid it if I could. But, hey, we're doing it. So whatever. Now, this one is also a hardcore Angry Orchard, which means that it has 8% alcohol by volume. Whereas the regulars have two apples in every bottle. And they say I don't put enough fruit in my body. Uh, this one has, oh, I picked the wrong time to do this. Oh, 5% alcohol. So a little bit, obviously a little bit stronger, but not as, not as much as I thought. I was thinking that because it was eight, this was closer to like four. We have a repeat from last year, which is the Cineful Apple. And I'm very curious about this one. I don't remember exactly how I felt about it. Um, but I'm curious about this because the final one is the one that I'm looking forward to the most. And that is baked apple pie. And I, I'm curious because cinnamon is a heavy ingredient, if I'm not mistaken, in apple pie. So how similar are these going to taste? I don't, I don't know. I have really high hopes for this one. I hope this one's like super sweet, but um, 
we will uh, we will have to find out. I have just gotten them all in my own way. I keep clanking the bottles. I apologize. Sorry, headphone users. Let's uh, let's jump into the first one, which is regular hard cider. Well, I can't remember if these are twist off or poles. It is a. I gotta find a thing. Damn it! I gotta find a thing. Hold on. We'll be right back. And we're back. I, I don't have like an ad to run or anything. That would be a good thing to like throw to. I watch a streamer who does that, who like throws like MediaTek clips up there. If I could do that and throw to like an ad, that'd be great. <sighs> that is so irritating. Okay, so I have to use this can opener as a bottle opener. So this will only go well, I'm assuming. I'm going to open it towards all my expensive electronics. I don't know how to do this. Does this have a bottle opener? What are we doing? What are we... What are we doing? Does this have a bottle opener? Oh no. Have I have I shown how much stupid I am? Hello? Please? Please? A bottle opener at all? Oh, here we go. Here we go. <laughs> okay. Come on. Off of the <laughs> Whew, I felt dangerous. Okay. Angry Orchard, hard cider. Here we go. I think the last time I did one of these, I recorded a video immediately after, which is what I'm going to do again this year. Oh, that's good. I love the Angry Orchard stuff. Big fan. Okay. Got our palette figured out. We're working with it. We're going to move to the next one. I'm going to move that away from myself because I know for a fact I'm going to knock it over. Just to be clear, I did eat before I did this. I have some water. I don't remember when I poured it, but there's water here. I had raisin bran. So. Really, uh. Really. <laughs> Stop it. I can't. <laughs> this is the worst. Where's the thing? Oh, I knew I should have recorded this earlier in the day. Where's the flip? Flip. 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 There we go. Oh, it's so much scarier. Laptop, a series S, a monitor. There's a lot going on for me to be like shaky hand in it. This one doesn't doesn't have much of a smell, which is weird. The other one very much smells like apple. Yeah, it's cherry. It's the cherry that I don't like. I knew I wasn't going to. And also because it's harder, it has more alcohol in it, which means that that flavor is in there as well, which I'm not a fan of. So this is like apple, like hard cider, which is like, ooh, yeah, pretty great. But it's like heavier on the alcohol. I like it sweeter, like muted, mute the alcohol flavor sweet. And then there's cherry ruining everything. I'll take a second sip. Yeah, that one's, that one's bad. That one's bad. I would not be surprised if that one was the worst of the batch. All right, next up, Cineful Apple. I'll try this again. I guess I could go over here. It's still on camera if something goes wrong. Kind of. Hold on. Rotate. Rotate. Hold on. Mute for burp. All right, there we go. I burped and then it was immediately it worked. Come on. Oh, it's so scary. It is so scary. Okay. This one doesn't have a, a great smell either. What is happening? Am I, is it just me? I don't think either. No, none of these have a great smell. Okay, neither. Uh, right. did, did I do something to my nose? All right, Cineful Apple. Uh, 
It's okay. So they, hold on, hold on. Let's have some water. This one's not good. Question mark, question mark, question mark. Hard side with other natural. There's like no cinnamon here. It's good till November 2023. We're well within the expiration date. Weird. I don't remember. I don't remember disliking this one. To be fair, I don't remember liking it. Do I have the footage? I might have the footage. What, what if I didn't like it? What if I did not like it last time around? That would have been the ultimate play right there. I always say welcome to a new episode of Taste Test. What if it was a repeat? What if I just put up... <laughs> oh, I was not paying enough attention. I was too busy talking. What if I just put up a... a... Oh, that's what I could do director's cut of this episode is me trying the original two from last year and then the new two from this year this is how i come up with so many ideas is that i think it's entertaining to myself and then other people just kind of suffer through it oh ho, ho. yeah that smells great it genuinely smells great for whatever reason, I thought that this one had like a stronger scent. The first one, the right, the regular Angry, or Angry Orchard. These didn't really have any. The hard cherry and the or the hardcore cherry and the cinnamon. I thought the cinnamon would have like a, a bit more of a scent, but this smells really good. Did it go away? Is it like the first like aroma is like right? No, it's there. It's there. It smells good. It smells like apple with like a, a like frosting scent oh it's good that's really good this is really this is so good oh man almost it actually makes it worth the 22 dollars i spent on this which if you average out by bottle still less than those stupid cashews i bought this is really good. There's a, like a, it's, exa it's exactly what I thought it would be. It's the regular kind of angry orchard flavor, but it's even sweeter, which is good for me because I like the sweet side of things. Um, but it has like a frosting taste to it. This is fantastic. Fantastic. Wish this was a, a holiday flavor you could just get by itself. I think that's a fantastic way to do it because I don't think that, I mean, the excluding the original, the other two that are come in this, the Cinefol and the the Cherry, aren't great. Um, but this one is terrific. God, I, I wish I had just a, a case of this. This is really good. Really good. So there you go. There you have it. Uh, I found it at Grocery Outlet. I've also seen it at places like Walmart and Fred Meyer, though I'm assuming that because it's at Grocery Outlet, it's probably gone from the regular shelves. Um, so you might have missed your chance on it. Sorry about that. Um, but if you see it and you like hard cider and you like the Angry Orchard, I would say if you like the original, maybe pick it up because best case scenario, you are probably going to like half of it at least. And maybe you like the Hardcore Cherry, which is the other new flavor this year. And even if you don't really like the Cineful, that's still only like a quarter of a case that you're not really going to drink or can you know, take to a party or whatever. I don't know what you do in your free time, but I think that the, uh, the baked apple pie is a terrific addition. I think it kind of makes the whole case worth it personally. Um, but I understand if you look at it and you go like, oof, $22 plus like alcohol sales tax or whatever. And you go like, oof, no, thanks. I understand. This is, uh, this is, this is really good. Really, really good. If you'd like to find out what happens after this video and when I drink all four of these, be sure to check out Monday's Demolicious video because that's what I'm going to record next. Thank you so much for watching this uh, lovely video. Hopefully you enjoyed. Uh, we will be back next week with another 
random item, maybe holiday themed, maybe not. I don't know. I have a bunch of just kind of crap. So there you go. You can uh, you can find out what I wa uh, what I try uh, next time around. Again, thank you so much for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed. Be sure to scroll down, subscribe, ring that bell. While you're doing that, you can let me know down in the comments below if you'd like to see something specific on the show. Just tell me what it is and where I can find it, and I will go try and find it myself. And you might see it on a future episode. And best way to do that, make sure that you're uh, you're getting those notifications in your inbox. Skip all the videos you don't want to watch. Check this one out every Saturday. Thanks again for watching, and uh, cheers. Clink.